I'm back. <laughs> um, I guess it only takes like for my iPhone about 15 minutes. So, and I think what I'm actually gonna try, cause I haven't done this before, excuse me. I'm gonna try and hook it up to my computer, my laptop. My dad fixed my laptop for me. So I was like, yes. Cause like I had my laptop and it was really weird because I couldn't get onto YouTube. I couldn't get onto anything. So I was like, hmm. I don't know what to do. So my dad spent like a couple hours working on it when I told him not to spend too many hours on it, but he's an electrical engineer, so couldn't help himself. He got it to work though. Everything works again. I'm actually really shocked because I actually like it. And I've been watching videos and stuff on it and stuff like that. So I don't know. I'm, I'm a really, I'm a techie person. I don't know why, but I really like tech when it comes out. Like obviously my favorite iWatch or Apple Watch and uh, I have my iPhone 7 Plus, I've got my iPhone 6S Plus and I have a 5S. And um, it's really funny because my sister was the one who suggested iPhone to me and I would always bash iPhone, Apple and be like, oh, they're just consumers. It's just, they're gonna take your money and blah, 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 you know, and stuff and I love it. I will never go back to Android. And it's funny because I have an Android tablet, but I actually don't use it much anymore because I love my Apple products. And I have my two iPods that I still have. And the goal is to get an iPad or a MacBook, but I'm thinking about getting an iPad. I don't know yet, but I really, really love iPads. I love Apple. I love Apple everything. Like I'm obsessed. I don't know why, but I am. And I'm trying to get the Series 3 because I'm actually on Virgin Mobile for the Apple Watch. And for some reason, I don't know why, but it doesn't, it doesn't communicate with Virgin Mobile. And I'm not sure why, like the Series 3, it has, I think, Verizon, AT&T, no, no. Yeah, I think AT&T or something. I don't know what it is, but they're all combined and stuff. And it's just like, it's weird to me, like, I don't know. And hopefully they will because Virgin Mobile is all iPhone now. So it's kind of like, hmm, very interesting kind of thing, but whatever. But yeah, so I'm thinking about doing that and uh, maybe doing some videos on that or whatever because my mom actually has one and I really like it. Um, going this way. Okay, let's see here. Um, does she have it? Yes. Okay, here we go. This is my mumsy's room. This is her phone that she has, and then she has oh, an iPad, which is really, really nice. I don't think she uses it much, though, but it's really nice. I like it. It's actually a really nice one. It has a little sensor and everything. I helped her set it up. I helped her get the case for it. Yeah, I kind of got jealous when I saw that. So I was like, wow, your school gave you a free iPod iPad for that? Oh. I got pretty jelly, I won't lie to you. I like Apple, but it's okay. <laughs> so, but you know, whatever. I, I can I can get one when I want to. And I might ask it for a part of the Christmas present too, but my dad said he had something really, really special that he got personally for me. So I'm kind of excited about that. And I'll do a Christmas you know, opening obviously on Christmas day or the day after, kind of depends. But yeah, sometime I will definitely show you guys my stuff that I got from uh, <clears throat> uh, Japan that my brother and sister got for me. And I showed you the little bag and I showed you the little bell that they got blessed by the priest, I think, the J Japanese priest or something like that. So I thought that was kind of cool. Um, yeah, so I don't know. I'm kind of bored. I'm just waiting for my parents to get home. Maybe I will show you guys a few things. Let's see. <sighs> Kind of scared to go down there of so much stuff. I don't even know if I should show you guys because it's kind of scary. <laughs> it actually scares me and I'm the one with all the stuff. But let's see what we got going down here. Uh, ooh, lights would be nice. Yeah, kind of scared to like put my phone down a little bit because I have so much stuff. Uh, ah. I don't know where it is. I think I have it downstairs somewhere, but yeah, I'm turning my phone this way because I have so much stuff. You guys just saw it, I'm sorry. Oh! <laughs> yeah, I have so much stuff, it's incredible. I'm like, ah. Oh. But this is really cool too. I don't know if you guys have seen this, but this is the coolest poster. Um, Let me get it out here. <sighs> okay, so story behind this. Not the clothes. Oh, man, you guys. Dang. Anyways, <laughs> I got this for like $4 at Hastings. 
The reason being is because Hastings was closing down and they were selling all their stuff. And I have been eyeing that poster for like ever. You have no idea how long I've been eyeing that poster for. And uh, <laughs> I really wanted it. <clears throat> and it was always like $14 or something like that. And I'm like, well, I really don't want to spend $14 for it, but I will spend maybe 10 and then it went down to 8.99 I was like well maybe if I wait a little bit longer maybe and it did it went down to 3.99 I was like oh yes and the cooler thing about it is it went to a dollar 99 it says four dollars on the poster dude I got it for two bucks <laughs> it's a little bent because I accidentally put it behind something and it kind of got wrecked but I don't know but Oops. <laughs> so yeah, I really like it, you know, and stuff. I, I have a lot of stuff that I cherish and, you know, there's certain things that I care a lot more about. Like I said, my jewelry, my jewelry is very important to me, especially uh, this gold ring. I swear it's going to be the death of me. Every time I turn around, it's like gone. It's horrible. And I usually wear it on my finger, but when I uh, come home, sometimes I take it off just because I like my finger to like... <sighs> I don't know what the right word is, like, relax or whatever, so that's part of it. But I have it on, finally. I did my nails the other night, so there we go. But yeah, this ring is really, really important to me. I usually wear it on that finger, but sometimes I'll wear it on different ones, kind of depending. I don't know. But yeah, so tomorrow is just going to be a laid-back day. And I'll show you guys all the stuff I got from Japan because let me tell you, it's freaking awesome. Like, it's really pretty. Like, some of the stuff, I got a fan, I got some chopsticks, got that little bag I absolutely love, I got some socks, I got a lucky coin, um, I got some pens too, which are really cool. My brother said that the Tower of Terror is no longer existent in um, California, so I thought, oh, that's cool. So he got me some pens and stuff like that. So I, I thought that that was really cool. And it's sad because tomorrow's their last day. So, no, it's done Sunday? No, Saturday. I think it's Saturday, I'm not sure. But, you know, it's been fun. And it's always hard to say goodbye. I think that that's kind of what goes with everybody, especially when I don't get to see my brother often. So it makes it a lot harder. And, you know, I'm, I'm close with my brother. I think we grew up pretty darn close. We, uh, we were little pals when we were younger, so, you know, still are, but, you know, it's different, especially since he's married and stuff like that. And, you know, him and his wife are off doing things and living in a different state. And, you know, that's why it's kind of a treat for him when he comes down here, because then we get to visit him and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, but, mm-hmm. Christmas story so look at the turkey sitting there come on man <sighs> yeah but like I said I got all decorated and stuff like that I put some because we have a, a window at my uh, location so I put all the um, snowflakes and everything on it sorry if it's like going back and forth I'm in a rocking chair right now uh, <laughs> so yeah like I said I kind of get in the holy spirit it's kind of fun and festive and New Year's is coming up and all that kind of stuff and I'm pretty sure I have New Year's off and I'm still debating if I should go to my work Christmas party but I'm thinking I will. It's on the 10th of, uh, no, December, duh, gosh. And uh, the only thing I don't like about it is it's on a Sunday so we shall see but I already put my name in that I'm going and you know the last time I had a, I had a pretty good time and stuff like that and one of the co-workers I really love is going and so that's kind of why I want to go to kind of relax and stuff like that but yeah so I've been talking for quite a bit I'm a girl I can do that <laughs> but you know, I really hope everybody else is doing okay and you know if you're new to my channel you can subscribe if you want to you guys can comment about anything if you want to get to know me and stuff and you know I'm trying to do this more to kind of get myself out there I finally you know feel like I'm ready to and hopefully people you know are nice but you know it's the internet obviously people people comment you know stuff like that especially with bigger youtubers like you know I think one youtuber I love is like you know Ben Phillips Gigi Gorgeous um, 
I don't know. I, I watch a lot of YouTube. It's crazy. Like I come home and that's like all I do is watch YouTube or videos and just kind of relax and just like take my mind off of things. And I think everybody needs to do that. And I have the weekend and this whole week has thrown me off because, you know, I worked on Thursday and it feels like Tuesday to me. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, work was okay yesterday. It was pretty busy, but you know, such is life, right? It's having a job. It's as long as I have a full-time job benefits, I'm good. And I really like what I do. You know, I, I've said that before. I know I have, but I really do enjoy what I do. I love my coworker um, who just got up here and so it's awesome. We're gonna have a great time and they do a good job. They're quick, they're efficient and you need that with your job. You know, you need somebody that you can count on who's gonna be reliable. And you know, I've had really good employees in the past. So it's always nice to know that the next employee is still gonna be good. Cause I've had some, you know, different places and stuff like that that I worked, um, you know, when I was younger. It's always, you know, you're always gonna have an employee you don't like, but that's life. Doesn't mean you have to, you know, love them or be their best friend. You just have to get along with them. And that's nice for me at Quail Run cause I really don't have that. So, which is really, really nice. Everybody I work with is pretty darn awesome. And I really appreciate everybody and yeah, we have a really good relationship there. So <clears throat> it's always good to like what you do because you're there most of your time than you're at your own house. I mean, that's pretty much like your home. So I don't know, that's, that's what I think. That's always what I've known about jobs and stuff like that when I finally got a professional job. So, but <clears throat> yeah, so now I get to enjoy my weekend, go out tomorrow to the White House Grill, have garlic and smell of garlic for the next like five days. <laughs> No, wow. it'll be fine. It'll be fun. It's kind of our last hurrah before my brother and his wife leave, which is really sad. But we'll see them again. They'll, they'll, they'll be here, and you know we're gonna plan a trip, and yeah. So they need to get back to work and stuff, and start everything going up again. And you know, since the holidays are coming around, it's a lot busier. So. Yeah, well, I hope everybody has a fabulous weekend, and um, let me know what you want me to talk about, what I can talk about, any questions, concerns, comments, whatever. Just comment down below. If you want to subscribe, you can, and yeah, so have a good weekend, you guys. Bye.